lots of stuff inside. Okay, Jonesboro is only 77 miles. That's what I feared. 78, 78, 79. Okay, there is some that are further. 104. Or Pine Bluff is only 82. That 104 looks really inviting. Uh, actually, that's even better, isn't it? Yeah. X Tech Machine. Okay, I've got to drive a bit further to get there, but that's alright. Because I wanted to go to the thing anyway. Otherwise, El Dorado all the way down there. I think Jonesboro is really good because that sets me up for quite a few other connections. If we can then do Jonesboro to Pine Bluff, then that'll be 100 miles. Or across to Harrison. The, these four are going to be really annoying, I can tell already. We might have to just jump across to like Tulsa or McAllister or something to actually get those. A request bingo set. Let's do this. I mean, I'm definitely open to that. I, I have no objections to someone requesting me do something that I was probably going to do anyway. That's fine by me. <laughs> you should have made it the blackout. That's a lot more points though, I know. The column you did is by far the easiest. Alright. I mean, I was wanting to do more bingo again at some point and get back into it. And Turn what I right. used to do is a variety. Like I would start with one and then work my way through a few Never of the mind. options. So, yeah, I'm open to exploring it. I just need to find the time, but... <laughs> Let's drive around the block here, if I can. It tells me that I can, but he's... No, this is one way, isn't it? Oh, it's indicating that I was meant to go the other way. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I just wanted to discover the question mark down here. I didn't realize I was going the wrong way. Ah, it's just not a recruitment agency. Oh. We'll dip our nose in. Recomputing. Then we just don't need to trouble ourselves with this part of the city again. Please make a I do button. wish that they had different designs for the recruitment agencies, because they are all the same. And I would prefer that they weren't all the same. Finding new routes. I think that it should be distinct. Her state, ideally, have the state flag out the front or something. Anyway. All that aside. Little Rock. I love the mural. Do they have foxes there or something? I don't know. That's cute. Bank. It's often a case of, what am I looking at here? <laughs> Is that a depot? Is that a... No, that's just a... Uh, Gas station, alright. <laughs> this is syncing up with the music very nicely. <laughs> Little Rock, Jewel of the Orient. Helicopter, that's topical. A happy chapel, alright. That's got a bit of a skyline. I wonder if I can increase the draw distance or something. But that that water texture, I've said it before, I'll say it again, the water in this game has much more detail than it has any right to being. It, it looks so good. Like, this is a truck driving game and the water is better than games that are much more centered around water. It's better than the Call of the Wild angler water texture, I'm fairly sure. It's insane. Anyway, <laughs> on to the next uh, pickup, shall we? Turn left. Keep left. Yep. Gotta go get supper. All right, do a lurk for a bit. No, oh, well, thanks for dropping in, and yep. Yeah. Always happy to have lurkers. Another photo op. I'm guessing it's the giant church or state building or something that's right there. Let's check this out. That's two in one city. What do we got? It is the Church of Little Rock. Alright. 
Cool. Very grandiose. Kind of interesting that it's got... It, it's, it almost looks like a city hall. It's an alt design. The little house on the hill in behind, which I'm trying to keep in shot as well. That'll do. Take a picture. I'm not going to mess with it that much. I think that looks good enough. Keep right. Cruise control. Oh yeah, we can't do scenic mode yet because uh, we don't have a trailer, so all we see is the back of the cab. I forgot that we hadn't picked up the trailer yet. Okay, up on the northeastern part of town. Keep right. Little Rock Thank is a reasonably spread out city, and I appreciate that they have you going to essentially Keep the outskirts right. And then turn right. to pick up your deliveries, not in the middle of the city, Leave like you do in some other places. Your route guidance is now finished. I feel it's more common, especially in Europe Truck Simulator, that you have to pick up a delivery in a city area, simply because that's where the industry has been for hundreds of years and the city's grown around it. So it's not much choice. Which direction am I picking this up? This one. Okay, good. Good. I did, did get it right. Now. Yeah, and I think we rely on this mirror to tell us what our angle is like. Seems more reliable. We've got a better angle than if we were to use our left mirror, interestingly. I mean, it's basically the, the mirror that is on the inside of the circle is what you want to be looking at, I think. So there's more down this particular road. Looks like there's another big depot, probably a big rail yard depot at the end. We'll leave that for another time. I'm not going to be exhaustive about discovering everything right off the bat. We expect that we'll probably be back to Little Rock. It's a bit of a hub. If we have to, we can always fast travel back here to pick up deliveries to other places. We know that there's deliveries to other cities in the state. Oh, left, not right. Why did I think I was turning right? <laughs> Brain fade already. Go straight. Yeah, I'm not going to be shying away from fast traveling to cities that I've been if I've noticed that they have cargoes to other cities that I need to get to. But only as a last resort, really. I would rather drive to one of the other cities and then take a delivery from there than fast travel to Turn getting right. a delivery to there, if that makes sense. I love how they've just got these sporadic little wetland areas. We've got a few of those over here that are like in the gaps in motorway junctions. Gives a little bit of a spot for drainage from the motorway. And just adds a little bit of colour, which is nice. Eighty-one miles to Memphis. Well, wow. foreshadowing. <laughs> I'm sure we'll get there eventually. Is it just me, or do they seem to have been stepping it up on their development as well? I don't know. I feel it wasn't that long ago that I was in a different state. Then time flies when you're busy. Hysteria one mile. We don't need that just yet. We will worry about that another time. This will be another five minute or so delivery, looks like. The thing is, we have the 100 mile minimum, and we're barely scratching that when it comes to the cities that we're going to. I mean, we're going to the city that's basically up in the corner, so our next delivery is probably going to be a little bit longer. But so far, we've pretty much just done a diagonal line and just happened to stop at Little Rock along the way. But the fact that it's only taken us like 15 minutes of driving, 20 minutes of driving, not sure which, to get from corner to corner, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not a big state. I do feel they should consider releasing maybe two at a time sometimes. I mean, they did that with the Balkans in ETS2 because it 
they wouldn't have just dribbled out one country at a time, and the, Balk uh, the Baltic for that matter as well. And no stranger to releasing kind of multiple areas at once in a package. I guess the problem is how to package them together and what makes sense in a United States context. Also just the differences, uh, the distances in the states are that much larger. I guess Arkansas is probably the size of a couple of Balkan countries. Why does it seem so dark all of a sudden? Is it just like really, oh yeah it is just really cloudy all of a sudden. Huh. That's a new weather effect I feel. I not really noticed that before, it's just gotten all gloomy. Put our lights on if they're not already. Keep right. Okay, Head they are now. Right. I really shouldn't look at the front of the truck when I'm driving in third person. <laughs> Exit right. Exit right. Oh, okay. I didn't realize. Blytheville and St. Louis. I was thinking, oh, I'm turning left. It's like, yes, but I need to exit right to go left because the main road keeps going. Sure. I just need my high beams on. <laughs> Okay, to be fair, it's also 8pm. I, I did lose track of what the time was in the game. Keep right, and then exit right. We don't need to actually stop for another 8 hours. Exit That's right. kind of crazy. But I feel after this Come one, straight. I might just sleep till the morning. Because I'd prefer that than driving through the night. This is a new state that I'm exploring, and I don't want to do it in darkness. Ooh, a little bit of a sun ray effect. Yes. Purple Heart Trail, apparently. Sounds historic. And we must be close to the city border. We should be discovering fairly soon. Keep left. And then what that will allow us to do is... Yep, there we go. Jonesboro discovered means we can now fast travel back here, we can buy the garage. We can do that anyway. Any of the other places, like we can buy the garage in a place that we haven't been to before, remotely. And just then fast travel there, travel to garage, and then pick up deliveries if we need to. Again, rather not. Right. Last resort, but right. if we have to. Exit right. Get ready to turn right. Once again, time for the in cab view. Turn right. This reminds me of turn Idaho right. a little bit. Okay, I will actually wait for the traffic here because I could see this stuff coming through. Let's see how long we have to wait for the light. Longer than I would want to. Oh, they're going now. Well, I don't see anyone else coming, so... <laughs> That's enough law-abiding for me. Another photo opportunity. Interesting. Where do we go? Oh, this is one way along here anyway. Cool. 
Is it a big courthouse or something? What's our photo of? Oh no, it's, it's not the building to our immediate left, it's actually the next one along. That's interesting. A statue and a big building of some description. Well, I'm stopped at the lights anyway, let's take a photo. Jonesboro downtown. Okay, so it's just the general downtown. It is the county courthouse. I knew it. Why not just make that the focus of it? Because it seems to be what the photo opportunity is trying to, to work on the idea of. Uh, let's do something like this. And then we can zoom out to get a wider angle to include the road a little bit more. And then I think we probably want to make it daytime. Maybe even dawn. Just to get the detail on the statue. Because it's, it's not lit up. It should really be spotlit or floodlit. Is it 13 weather simply because it's Halloween? Is that, that what's going on here? Jonesboro downtown. No one's coming. It's a one-way road. Keep left, then turn left. Turn left. Get ready to turn left. Let's so working our way around. Oh, another nice mural. Interesting. Turn left. Lions instead of foxes. See, now that should be an achievement, is discovering the murals. Okay, where do you need it? How about no? That looked complicated. I don't feel like doing complicated right now. I'm not Avril Lavigne. Uh, am I going to have to reverse in a bit again? Yeah, okay. I didn't have the right angle. That's fine. this into the back corner and then twist it in there we go perfect that should take me to three out of ten fantastic Jonesboro Little Rock Little Rock and Texarkana done that's a good start but no happy Halloween yet <laughs> we still haven't been able to do those treats we might just have to do those without worrying about a target.